Yo guys, Jarek the Game and Dragon doing some Halo Reach gameplay. This time we're doing some Slayer on the map Reflection. And uh, I know I've uploaded a lot of gameplay on this map, a lot of just plain Rumble Pit here, but uh, if you don't like it, you clicked on it, so blame yourself. Anyway, I spawned next to the shotgun, but I don't do the Halo fag thing of picking up the shotgun, then running to the sword and picking up any other power weapons that are closer to me. I hate it when people do that. Love but uh, I couldn't aim with the shotgun anyway, so it didn't really matter. Somehow miss him with both the melee and the shot, but then a Thor grenade which bounces off the wall, gets stuck in the ceiling, hits the ground, and then blows up and kills the guy. My grenade bounced off three walls before it finally blew up, and I got a kill out of it. I, I don't, don't even understand how that works. And we got with the jetpack. I thought I had this guy, but no, apparently he wasn't out of jetpack, so whatever. Charged up shot, no shields. The first shot should have killed him, but it took two shots, and he almost killed me, and one bullet ended up killing me. I might have been able to survive longer if the shotguns actually had more than fucking two feet of range in this game, but no, you can't hit anything with the shotguns, so that's cool. The shotguns are useful, but, um, god, I don't know why they made, like, in real life, target rounds have more range, more kill range, than the shotgun does in this game. It just makes no sense. Anyway, I picked the shotgun back up, so that's cool. I got a shotgun. Let's just go back up this ramp. I, I spend a lot of my time going up right over here in the, uh, this end of the map. This isn't really the converging point either. Everyone tends to go to the other side, because I kill a guy that has a sword. No, you're not going to get me with that. I'm your only weakness. I have the shotgun. Uh, but ultimately, I didn't even get to use the sword or the shotgun after this, because uh, I get killed by someone that just gets some lucky grenade throws, because he sees me on the radar. Dude, look at that. I had almost full shields, and one grenade killed me. That's just, that's okay. Grenades are a little bit too fucking strong there. I've noticed the grenades are back to being Halo 1 strong, they just don't have as much blast radius as they did in Halo 1. So. Oh, and also here, good example of why you always use the pistol. I didn't even have full shields and I still killed that guy. The pistol will always kill faster than the assault rifle. Unless you're almost dead, like right there. Um, but if you are if you actually know how to aim, use the pistol, don't use the assault rifle. Your assault rifle is like your backup, even though the pistol is supposed to be a sidearm. I, I know, it's kind of weird. But right here seems to be the converging point, as a guy with a shotgun misses me, somehow, and then I kill him, so that's cool. I'm going to pick up the shotgun now and use it. And uh, set a trap for someone, because I see someone below me, and I know he's going to come up the the, uh, the man cannon, or the grab lift. There's just no way you're going to survive that. But yeah, over here on this side of the map is the main converging point, where everyone goes over there, and I always go up the ramp by the shotgun on the other side. I never go up this side for some reason. Also, if you notice what I just did there, I have a power weapon that's good up close, and uh, I didn't run out to the open <laughs> and try to charge into someone like everyone seems to do. It makes no sense. People have a shotgun, and they'll like sprint at you. And you're gonna kill them before they even get close to you. It's like, if you're gonna die, take cover. It doesn't matter if you have a power up and if you're going to die. Anyway, here, this this has to be the best sword kill ever. Well, not ever, just a good sword kill. Time it right, lunge and wabow! Get that guy. I got that guy from forever away, and he had a rocket launcher. Oh shit, the guy out of nowhere. Ah! Okay, that, that guy got the drop on me. I was kind of doing that post kill celebration. I was like, dude, I can't believe I killed a guy. That was awesome. And then he just drops out of nowhere and has to ruin my celebration. Thanks, Killjoy. Asshole. And, uh, oh, hey, look. It's a sword guy. Have some grenades. Get the fuck away. Well, none of my grenades kill him, but whatever. I still got him. And then it, he, ugh, oh, what an asshole. He has to drop a grenade before he dies and, uh, leads to my death. Could've had the sword. Could've ran away with it, but nope. Someone had to hurt me afterward. Dude, that is why you get so many assists in this game. A lot of the assists you get are from hurting someone, then dying, and then someone else killing them. So you get an assist while you're dead. Stop. Oh, and this is this is just the biggest amount of bullshit. Look how much I shoot him with no shields, and he fucking just shoots me once. Yeah, bullshit. No. That should have been my kill. He probably had, like, literally no health. Your health can get as low in this game to where you can't even see it anymore. It rarely happens, but it happens. Need the rifle. I love this need the rifle. I, I think I miss the carbine a little more, uh, but the need the, just the needle rifle is so much cooler than the carbine was. It's not quite as good. It's just cooler. I also really miss the battle rifle. I wish they added the battle rifle back in instead of the DMR. Like the DMR is just not fun to use. It's also way too damn strong. It's a little overpowered. They should nerf the uh, the power to that thing a little bit. Like I don't care if it has the uh, the reticle blooming. I, I don't care. The power is a little better. I'm not using that sniper on me. Get out of here. Ow. Stop dropping grenades. And this gun here is so... When you're up close, good god, it destroys people. 
But, whatever. Found a shotgun, so didn't need to use it. No one was picking up the shotgun this match. It was kind of weird. Like, normally everybody always picks that shotgun up, but not this time, I guess. Where is everybody? Oh shit, there's someone. Yeah, throwing grenades at me. Oh, man, I don't know how that guy didn't die. See, shotguns need to have more range in this game. I understand they're trying to balance out the shotguns, but when the shotgun has an accurate range of two feet, one, you either have one really shitty shotgun, or, oh god, I just got fucked there. <laughs> By everyone. But, um, yeah, if your shotgun has a range of two feet, I sh just, no. Just, no, that that's never an excuse. I hate how games the shotgun has no range. What is this? Why? I don't understand it. I will bitch about that every single game. Oh god, people are everywhere. Ah! So many people! <laughs> yeah. That's why I love the Needler. Good god, this is awesome. And I don't know how I'm surviving this. Two grenades in my face. That guy dies. I shoot the guy that picks up the sword and tries to run away. Give me that. Now I got the sword and full health and full shields without picking up a medikit. Did you see how low my health was before? I don't understand how I was able to do that. And now I'm gonna go on a spree because I got the sword. I didn't. I didn't get unlucky this time. God, I think they changed the uh, the lunge radius. It's a little bit less in this one. I mean, it's still pretty ridiculous, but it's a lot less than uh, it was in Halo 2 and Halo 3. Although I miss how I kind of miss how fast you can do the uh, the Halo the regular melee with the sword, like you could in Halo Three, and I probably <laughs> probably scared the living fuck out of that guy. But um, I miss how in Halo Three they did all they had a bunch of sword fights. I love doing the sword fights. I don't know why, but when everyone has a sword and it's just chaos, everyone lunging at someone else, it was just fun. Um, and that's not a game mode at all anymore. But it's just not there. Hey, you guys. Have some grenades. I probably should have just sprinted in there because they were both distracted by each other. And I run under the guy with the jetpack. I knew he was there, but I wanted to get around the wall. So that he'd do that for some stupid reason. People in Halo just don't think. At all. I don't understand why. But they just kind of sprint in. How, how'd I miss? Yeah, no. No rocket launcher for you. Bad. Now where's your rocket launcher? It's for me. Uh, uh, here we go. And I get enough time to reload. Sweet. And uh, I knew that guy had a sniper up there. I just knew it. And I thought maybe I could get some time to uh, get a rocket shot off. And nope, that asshole sniped me. And this, this seriously was, st he was starting to piss me off. So, see over here. You know, there's just someone over there. And wow, I get sniped again with the same fucking asshole just camping up there. So I figure, okay, I'm going to go get this asshole now. Especially since I spawned right next to him. I start sprinting, and then for some reason, I don't know why I started, I thought about it, and oh, wait, there he is, but he has a rocket launcher too, so he's a sniper, rocket launcher, faggot. Whatever, I'm still in first place, and I'm determined to kill this guy, I want to get this guy now, because he killed me three times in a row, being a giant dickhole with a sniper and a rocket launcher, and uh, I'm going up here to kill this guy, but those two are fighting, actually no, it wasn't two of them, it was someone with a needler, fuck that, and backing up. And I got an assist. I actually kind of got lucky that there was an assist. Where'd everybody go? <laughs> oh, hello. Bap. Just camp here for a little bit. That's something about Halo that I've noticed. When you have... Everybody just hardcore watches their radar. As I run up on some guy with a shotgun and... Ah, he has a grenade. Oh my god, look at my health. <laughs> I have one little bar of red health. Camp. When you're not moving, obviously, you don't show up on the radar. And people watch the radar so much, if they see nothing on the radar, they just sprint in. And my last kill is, a uh, kill stolen by someone else. And I don't manage to kill him. And I never got revenge on that jerk-off. But, um, and guess what? Who won in the end? Yeah, I won in the end. So fuck you, sniper.